Hey guys, it's Lenny and welcome back to the channel. So in this one, I'm going to show you guys how to receive the Pegasus vehicles and by Pegasus vehicles, I mean the nightclub party bus and I mean the Dune, okay? Obviously not the Dune FAV, it's the big Dune, the one you can see, the blue and white one just there. Okay, so we can actually apply mods to them and store them in our garages. So first of all, you need to be glitched out for gift card of friends. Okay, so I'm doing the method where you enter the terabyte garage and join your friend that's in a different session. Okay, this is the easiest way to get glitched out with gift card of friends. You can use the other method that I posted with the arena, but um, I'm going to be showing you the method that um, I use mostly. And yeah, it's very, very easy to do. Okay, I'll link the full tutorial in of that video as well and the other Give Carter Friends tutorials um, in the description. But um, if you just watch this, this will show you how to get glitched out for Give Carter Friends. So you need to have the nightclub for Give Carter Friends. You need to have the terabyte garage for the method I'm using. Um, and you need to have MOC with personal vehicle storage and cars that you want to receive vehicles over stored in other garages. So once you make it to your nightclub, just go to your dashboard, join your friend once, okay? So the alert will come through quick. Okay, so you see here, I just join. I get the alert, I just decline it. And as soon as I decline it, enter the nightclub terabyte garage, accept it, double tap, go back to your friend that's in the other session and hit join. Okay, as soon as you do that, you spam the X button, accept all the alerts, and now you glitched out for gift card of friends once you join that session. The other thing you have to make sure you do with that gift card of friends is make sure you set your spawn location to last location, so outside, like you see me spawn. Once you've done that, make your way over to the gift card of friends spot. Okay, request out the car you're going to be receiving a vehicle over, so I'm using Fagios, and call out your MOC. Okay, and the MOC needs to have the personal vehicle storage. So, with the Pegasus vehicles, you can pretty much... Um, only do the party bus or the festival bus or whatever you want to call it or the dune. Now I did try to do the new, um, I can't even think of the name of it, the new vehicle, the new Pegasus vehicle that was just unlocked last week but we, once you get it in your um, MOC it just disappears okay so you can't actually store that. Make sure you purchase the dune or the festival bus or um, both or whatever one you want to do. So you have to do that, and then once you've purchased them, you just want to ring Pegasus and request them out. Okay, so you or the uh, person helping you with this can call them out. I actually had the other, my friend call them out, which is me on my other console, and um, brought them over to the gift card of friends spot. Alright, so I'm going to cut the gameplay so you don't have to see all that, but I've requested out the party bus, there it is. And I'm just doing gift card of friends right now. So get your friend to hop on the back, just tell them to either go to the story mode character wheel alert or just press pause. And you can drop up to the back of your MSC with the Fagio or the RH8 or whatever you're using to do gift card of friends. Press right D-pad, accept the personal full storage alert. Your friend will get kicked off, he can back out of that alert or pause menu now, you hop off. Now with this one, um, I do the different target mode alert because for some reason I can't do the down D-pad with the... Um, story mode character so you need to do whatever one works for you I have to do different target mode so I found my friend in a different target mode and I joined them once okay and on the first alert I'll join them again for the second time to make sure that it changes to a different target mode and I will decline the alert now what your friend has to do that's helping you at this point okay once you do this and you get glitched out and you fall down invisible um, and you're on the street, you, your friend is going to have to hop into the party bus so they're sitting in the driver's seat. Alright, so you do, get them to do that, you hop in, so you'll sit in a passenger seat. And what will happen is that you'll get sucked into the MSC with the party bus and your friend will get basically sucked into the MSC as well, but he'll spawn down at the docks. And it should look like this. Now, you're outside of the MSC at the moment, you can see the party bus is in there. To get out of this screen, you just join a job. Okay, so I'm going to join a mission first. You get frozen, and then you want to join a job like a stunt race, and then you can get kicked outside. Okay, so just join a mission. You'll see here, I join a mission. It says unable, now I'm frozen. Press pause, online jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created, and just go into a, um, like a stunt race. 
like once you do that you back out of the job and you'll be on foot back at the gift card of friend spot so you'll have to request your MOC out if you continue continuing to receive vehicles and um, try and have the cars that you're pulling out when you're doing gift card of friends try and have those Fagios or RHH stored in the arena so you don't have to muck around pushing the like the, the festival bus and the dune over there so once you do gift card of friends it'll automatically go to over to the arena and you won't have to push them around but you'll literally have to just push the party bus and the um, dune to that area so yeah, I've got glitched out, cut the gameplay, I'm receiving the dune, make sure you hop in the passenger side and same thing applies, you'll have to go on the job and back out to get out of this, out of the MOC sort of area. Now we have to unglitch ourselves from gift card of friends so we can enter like buildings, so all you need to do, depending on what gift card of friends you did, so the one I did was with a nightclub, walk over to the circle, get the menu up for the basement levels and back out of it, now you're unglitched. So make your way over to your arena now, um, providing the vehicles that you're going to merge, the festival bus and the dune are here. So this is the car that I'm going to be using to merge onto the um, dune. Okay, so just basically do the glitch for the merge. So you just change, I just change the wheels because it's a Benny's vehicle and then I'll just go to the armor, change the armor or we'll do something like that. And then go down to color, go to respray, you can either go to crew or metals. Okay, so I just go into crew, press my dashboard button, and then come back to GTA, hop out of this vehicle, and then walk over to the dune, okay, and then drive it outside. So it's fairly simple, obviously we just have to apply the gift card of friends like rules and the like arena merge rules. The only problem is we can't pull these vehicles into the workshop to purchase something on them to save them, um, so we'll just have to like either swap them around or change our outfit when we finish to make sure that they basically save. Okay, so that's the dune done. Fairly simple to do. You make your own dune. Now you can just do the party bus or the festival bus however you want. Okay, but I like to make it modded so it has all the bits on it. So the big skull, the speakers and the, um, the play deck. The best vehicle to use for this is the like one of the race cars. So I'm using the PR4. Alright, so just apply all the upgrades to the outside, like the wing and everything. If you max all the upgrades up, what it'll actually do is when you transfer it to the party bus, um, it'll actually put all the like components on it. Alright. Make sure when you're doing this, before you start the party bus as well, that it is standing upright so you can enter it. Okay, just make sure. Otherwise it's upside down, obviously you can't enter it at this point. Um, yeah, and you just drive it outside. Now, with the liveries, you can actually apply the liveries. So I just did the one with the first livery just to show you. I don't know the actual what liveries do what, but you can see there that when I, once I merged it, it put the livery on. Um, so yeah, I don't actually like the liveries on these vehicles. So I actually, um, yeah, I took the livery off just to show you. And the same thing applies with the dune as well. You can actually apply the two liveries to the vehicle as well. But I think it looks better without and um, that's how I make mine. Alright, so I'm going to do the glitch again just to get rid of that uh, livery that's on it. So I'm going to change the livery. Like you see. And just do the change the armor. Make sure. Alright, so you go to respray. Go to crew or metals. Go into the actual color itself. Press your dashboard button. Come back to the game. Pop out the vehicle and then drive it outside. And that's it, that's how you make these vehicles. Okay, you can make them without all the bits on top if you want, just merge it with anything. But if you want all the bits on top, like you see mine have, use the PR4. Um, I do believe it works with the other race cars as well. And you can make yourself a festival bus or party bus or whatever you want to call it, um, modded with yeah, all the mods applied. So obviously we can't take these in the workshop to save them, so just swap your outfit, swap the vehicles around, buy something just to make the game save, and these vehicles won't revert. That's it for the video guys, I hope you enjoyed it, take advantage while we still have it, I'm surprised it's still working, but we should um, get a patch tomorrow, Australia time, tomorrow night, and yeah, but yeah make sure you apply coloured headlights too. Alright guys, thanks for watching, see you in the next one.